welcome back to my channel. Today we're doing something really fun. We're doing a Disney haul and also a Shop Disney, uh, Disneyland Paris haul, if you will. Um, so let's just jump right into the video. So of course, you know, whenever you go Shop Disney, you have this Disney bag right here. My dad and stepmom went on a weekend anniversary trip and brought me back a few things. And my sister actually went to France for a student exchange program a couple of weeks ago. So she brought me back some things from the Disney store um, in Paris, France. So I'm really excited to show those to you today and just really get to feeling the Disney magic. Be sure to stay tuned after I show you everything because I have some really fun news that I'm going to share with you guys that I'm really excited about. So the first things I'm going to show you are from my sister's haul when she went to the shop disney store and the first thing she got me was this recyclable bag that has paris on it and it's just like one of those bags that you can use over and over again and it has Minnie and mickey on it and it has the disney store logo on the front top side so i really like this and i'm really glad she gave me this because i'm really trying to do um do good for the environment where I use these instead of the paper bags or the plastic bags and also even if I do use the plastic bags they have a check your local Walmart or grocery store wherever you shop because most of the time they have like a little garbage dispenser and you can recycle your plastic bags there so I'm really excited to use this plus it just makes you think about Disney whenever you're grocery shopping so who doesn't love that and the second thing she got me is something that I really, really was excited about. And she got me this Dumbo coffee mug. And it's so cute. It's from the new store that they just did. I'll be honest, I have not seen the movie yet. So please don't put any spoilers out there. But so it's like a red, white, and blue cup with... Um, Dumbo on it, and then it also has the circle circus on here, the Medici Brothers Circus right here. And I just think it's a cute, really cute cup. And one of my favorite things is that the edges are like scalloped, if you can see that. But I, I really just love this mug. And I don't know whether to drink out of it or just display it because it is so cute. I would not want to mess this up. And plus, you know, it came from Disney. I want to say, I keep wanting to say Disneyland Paris, but it came from Paris, so it's just really exci exciting piece to have in my collection because one day maybe I'll be, be able to go to Disneyland Paris, but I haven't yet, so maybe one day. That's that's in the books, so so this these items I'm fixing to show you now are from when my dad and stepmom went to Disney for their anniversary trip for the weekend a couple weekends ago, and the first thing they got me is this new phone case from the DTEC place. It's basically the Disney signs that you see right when you go through Disney. And it says where dreams come true straight ahead. And it has this cute little arrow on it. And um, this is actually out of the packaging because I've been using it <laughs> ever since they ever since they gave it to me. Um, but I saw this on Twitter. And so when my dad and, and stepmom went down, I was like, Dad, you have to let me know if they have this case because I want it. And um, I have the iPhone X, and if anybody has the new iPhones, um, they're a little bit heavier. To me, they're heavier than the iPhone 7s and 8s. Um, so having a case on it that's lightweight like this really helps outweigh how heavy the phone is. So um, I really love this case. I don't want to say it's like super durable because it is like really flimsy, but I try not to drop my phone a lot. So I mean, as far as the case goes, I mean, it's been pretty good to me, but I, I absolutely love it. And it's kind of crazy because people that don't know what Disney is, or they don't know a lot about it, they're like, what does this mean? And then you have those people that do know, and they're like, oh my gosh, I love this case. So I'll try to link it down below if I find it. That way you can, you know, get it for yourself if you want it. But yes, I definitely love this case. And then they were actually down there for May the 4th for Hollywood Studios. And, you know, Hollywood Studios is celebrating there. 30th anniversary celebration so they were able to snag me a new pen oh wrong pen <laughs> they were able to snag me the 30th anniversary celebration it has the date right here on it 
and I'll try to zoom that in close so you can see. But it's 30 years, Disney Television Studios, May 1st, 2019. I am super stoked to see this, to have this pin because I was watching um, Jen LaForge's video. If you don't watch her, you definitely need to check her out. Um, but she had gotten this pin because she was down there for the weekend also. And I was like, oh my gosh, I would love to have this pin. And so when they gave me my, my treat or my surprises for when they went, this pin was in the bag. And I was so excited to have it because I really do think it's a collector's item to have. And I'm just so stoked. I just think it's so pretty. And any pin that has Mickey on it to me is a win-win. So definitely not trading this one. They're going to keep it for a long time. So I've got that. And then, of course, they gave me some park maps for the 30th anniversary, which I thought was really nice. I really like how they put Mickey in the middle of it. I know a lot of people are not excited about the new um, Hollywood Studios, I guess, format, you would say. But I don't really have a problem with it. I think it looks good. But I really like how they put Mickey in the middle of the zero for the 30th. And um, really excited to use these and just have some for display. They gave me a lot of extras. And then the last thing they got me was this Minnie's Garden Party button from Epcot where you can meet Minnie in her garden outfit. So I'm glad that they were able to see the Flower and Garden Festival and everything like that so that concludes my haul i hope you enjoyed it and also here's the exciting news so in just a few weeks me and my husband are going down to disney world for the whole week i'm so excited i have not been on vacation since last august so i'm really excited i'm hoping to vlog while i'm down there for the first time i'm a little nervous because i know some people still aren't they don't understand what vlogging is but I'm really hoping I can get some new videos down there while I'm down there for you guys. Maybe do like a food review um, for places that we eat. I know a lot of people really like those. Um, I'm kind of bummed because I will be just four days shy of missing the Flower and Garden Festival. But that's okay. I'm not going to let that spoil my trip. So anyways, yeah, give this video a thumbs up if you've enjoyed the video. Leave a comment down below if you'd like to see more. Um, give me some ideas of what you guys would like to see. I love hearing from you guys in the comments. And also, if you're not subscribed, please subscribe down below. Um, I would love for you to be a part of this channel and just helping us grow together um, is a really awesome thing. So with that being said, I'll see you later. And remember, wherever you are, near or far, you can always come hang with me in Disney. I'll see you real soon. Bye-bye.